I love the office Halloween party. It is so much sluttier than the office Christmas party, though not as freaky as the office President's Day rave or the office tubish spot pajama jammy jam. Hey, guys. Hey, boss. Hey, Randy. Do uh, you want a beer? Oh, no, thank you. I brew my own. At the risk of bragging, my hazelnut pilsner won fourth prize of the Weehawken Retirement Home Clam Bake and Wheelchair Maintenance Picnic. I wouldn't consider any part of that bragging. Hey, uh, just occurred to me, is your friend, uh, what's her name? Gobbin? Flobbin? Robin. Robin. That's it, yeah. Is she coming tonight? Not that I really care. Robin has another party to go to. No! Damn it! But I'm leaving! But, but she might stop by later. Guess I can hang out a little longer. So, uh, anyone going to see the uh, Halloween parade? Oh, we were big fans of New York's annual Halloween parade. I don't mean the one that takes place Halloween night in the village. I mean the one that takes place the morning of November 1st. The annual post-Halloween Walk of Shame Parade. Look at them heading home after their dirty, filthy hookups. Oh, looks like that bee got busy. <laughs> looks like that French maid didn't turn down somebody's bed. Uh oh, looks like uh, Pocahontas has a couple of wounded knees. Come on, okay, Marshall. A line no, it's you just go, 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 we get it. Does it get any better than this? Uh, yes. Yes, it does. Uh, crap. <laughs>